Many years ago, photographers from our school documented an entire day at Burke from sunrise to sunset. After taking hundreds of photos during a single school day, they published a book titled A Day in the Life of Burke. This year, in celebration of our 50th anniversary, we've decided to take these photos to the big screen. This is our story. Good morning, Bert. This is Scott. I'm the facility director here, and uh, we get here early in the morning and make sure all the systems are working properly, and then we uh, move on with the daily work. This room gets up to 90 degrees during the day, which is too much for education. Well, obviously. We've got some old technology up in the ceiling. Here. Okay. Um. So one of the things, if you wonder why we put all the work in the morning, one of the things we'd like to do is make sure that we don't affect the student life experience here. And uh, so frequently you, you won't see a contractor come in during the day because I've taken care of it between 6 and 8 in the morning. You know how sometimes you watch those movies that are about like high school and people growing up and you're like, that's kind of ridiculous, right? And man, it's not really like that, it's not really like that, right? And then what happens is you start moving through your adolescence and you realize like that some of those movies are kind of true, you know, in terms of the messiness of the teenage years and how difficult it can be and how anxiety produces. So this experiment is to determine how much iron there is in a multivitamin tablet. In the first part of the experiment, you took a series of solutions of known concentration of the iron phenantholine complex, measured the absorbances, and created a graph of absorbance versus concentration. You saw a direct proportionality. The slope of that line allows you to calculate the quantity of iron in any solution. Fun field day of basketball here down in the physical education department with our eighth grade students in honor of the NCAA March Madness Tournament. Kids are excited to play. It means you simply have to find where this function has slope negative one. You don't, you're not pressing the button. Press it lightly. 
Yeah, that's lightly and hold it. Hold it light. Hold it light. Like, like press this like this. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> Get a picture of me helping the film crew make yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You just sorta started the cross notification right away. Uh, and that's not gonna. But yeah. Santa! Santa a la izquierda! Oh, and yep. has what relationship? Uh, see, ox, pecker, and rhino. Which is? A mutualism. Mutualism. Right, let's get to the things that work, shall we, for disease preventers. And that is, of course, the array, the fabulous amount of condoms that are on the market. The one that you will not go towards is the natural lambskin. HIV, herpes, you go right through this. Over 50 years, Burke has seen more than 9,000 school days come and go. No two days have been the same, nor will they ever be. So here's to good days gone and many more to come. Happy 50th Founders Day.